Foro Energy is commercializing high power lasers in the energy industry. We take the highest power industrial lasers in the world and we use our breakthrough technology to transmit these immensely powerful laser beams down fiber optic cables the size of fishing line. We integrate these lasers into conventional mechanical tools to allow the potential for breakthrough, performance, and capabilities. Most of our economy and jobs are powered by energy that we pull out from beneath the surface of the earth. For U.S. security and competitiveness, we need to produce as much of that energy domestically as possible. We also know that a good energy portfolio consists of clean natural gas and geothermal power. Technology innovation is a key to getting these next generation energy resources. Foro Energy's mission is to drill and perform a variety of other well operations faster, safer, cheaper, and more effectively than the conventional technologies today. We think the laser is going to do the same thing to the energy industry that it did to the telecommunications, automotive, and medical industries. I've been developing lasers for industrial and military applications for nearly 30 years. Over the past decade, fiber lasers have accelerated in technology development. In particular, they're a much more robust design, they're higher efficiency, they're more compact. And so now it enables us to take these lasers into the field. It occurred to me about three years ago that it would be very um, interesting to try and combine laser technology with the energy fields to try and help the growing energy needs of the world. The original RPE grant was to develop a laser drilling system capable of drilling through hard crystalline rock. The fundamental problem with achieving this was how do you transmit the laser power from the surface to the bottom of the borehole. This was thought to be impossible because of a nonlinear phenomenon called stimulated bullion scattering. And this phenomenon, once it reaches threshold, can actually cause the laser power to transmit backwards through the fiber rather than forward. The problem is that it could cause catastrophic damage to many of the optical components as well as the laser itself. This is a course that Foro Energy has worked to solve. With the help of RPE funding, Foro has been able to overcome this technical challenge of how to suppress stimulated Ruan scattering. And so we're very pleased that they've made tremendous progress being able to send high intensity laser light to long distances in fiber where many other people thought was going to be impossible. We're always on the lookout for innovation opportunities with the potential of step change performance in the energy industry. Historically, these have been incremental because it's easier for companies to improve upon their existing products. And it's really hard for small companies to overcome the barriers and challenges, whether they're technical, financial, or cultural. Over the past couple of years with the RPE program, Foro has been able to actually prove you can transmit high power over long distances. Understand the most efficient and productive way to remove rock and build a prototype that integrated commercial off-the-shelf products with high-power laser optical components that gives you the level of comfort we can use this technology downhole. We've now identified a set of industry partners that will help us not just to drill geothermal and oil and gas wells, but also rework existing wells to improve their production. When we wrote our initial RPE proposal, we were four people in a cramped office with an idea. A few short years later, we have significant additional financing, world-class energy leaders as partners, and a talented team in Colorado and Texas that combines the highly technical with the practical experience we need to make this happen. Lots of people have talked about using high-power lasers in the energy industry. We want to be the ones to do it. <laughs>